Egypt is a land blessed with plentiful plants and wildlife, making it an excellent place to settle your wandering tribe of hunters and gatherers. Even though your people have primitive technology and rely on stone tools, they are skilled hunters. Establish a small village on this Nile Delta island and grow your tribe to seven people. Somas. Tarai? Somas. Poplema? Aisa. Aisa Arai Aisa The hunt is a success and your tribe grows. You and your people will raise many sons and daughters in this land. For generations, the rich hunting lands along the Nile have provided for your people. Now a series of droughts have withered the size of the herds and forced your kin to forage for new food sources. Fortunately, the banks of the Nile teem with fruits and edible plants. Hunting bands have returned from the east with berries, dates, and leeks. Find these forage sites and collect food for your growing tribe. Once you have enough food, settle in this rich area by constructing a granary, storage pit, and dock. Somas. Oklema. Zokanta. Oklema. Zokanta.
Alamos. 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 Zelkanta. Though the desert sands have encroached on the grasslands, the banks of the Nile still provide for your people. Your tribe no longer wanders after the herds, but has begun to build a home here on the river. As your hunters venture out, they begin to encounter other cultures to the west, along the Mediterranean coast. You have sent parties of explorers to search the borderlands to learn about these people whom you call Libyans. According to legends, there are sacred sites nearby. These can be recognized by the shape of a white horse etched into the ground. Find the five discoveries before the encroaching Libyans do. Salmas. Alamos. 
Alamos. Alamos. Alamos. Alamos. Alamos. Alamos. Alamas, 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 Alamas. Alamas. Aisa.
my mouth. Aisa. 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 Alamas. 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 Aisa.
Your band of explorers has discovered the sacred sites and pushed back the invaders from the west. You do not believe this is the last you will see of these Libyans, however. Exploration and contact with other cultures have brought new ideas to Egypt. Your people are learning new skills, including technologies for fishing and more complex stone tools. Advance your culture to the Tool Age to gain access to these skills and new capabilities. Exploration and contact. Exploration and contact. Thomas. On this. Thomas. Thomas.
Alamos. this.
Summers. Alle Maas. Alamas 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 Summers Summers Your people have mastered the techniques of making improved stone tools and have entered a new age of development which will be called the Neolithic period. With these new technologies, your people thrive and gain an advantage on the other groups around them. New technologies have allowed your tribe to grow but have also brought conflict. The spread of the Sahara sands has forced neighboring tribes to migrate into your lands to seize control of your foraging sites and defensive positions. Raiding parties from Upper Egypt have come down the river. Intercept and destroy these invaders before they infiltrate your villages and steal your food supplies. Thomas. Thomas. Erectus. 
somos. Your people have repelled the raiders and are safe for now. Your successes and the threats of powerful neighbors have encouraged smaller nearby tribes to join you for safety. They offer food and their wealth in exchange for your protection. You have begun to lay the first foundations for a new concept called kingship. The future of Egypt is about to change. The great pharaoh Narmer seeks to unite the upper and lower kingdoms into a unified Egypt. Using the wealth brought from farming along the Nile's banks, he will finally be able to defeat his rivals. Take control of the villages along the river and build a surplus of 800 food to feed your people and Narmer's warriors. In addition, take control of the ancient stone circle of Nabta Playa, found in the desert to the west. Controlling this ancient ruin will demonstrate Narmer's power to his opponents. Be wary of nearby peoples, however. You need not destroy them, but know that they will attempt to undermine Narmer's goal of uniting Egypt. Summers. Rutger. Oh, no.
keyboard thought it rocked it. Oh, no. I can't.
resurrect us. Hmm. Arrest us. Evil Tade. Oklahoma. Pombus. Tadai. Pombus. Oklahoma. Bombes.
Hundreds.
Amazonas. Thomas. The gods have blessed our great pharaoh Narmer and united our people. Egypt is destined to become the greatest civilization ever seen. The Pharaoh has promised you a spot on the carved stone tablet commissioned to honor his victory. For obvious reasons, your image will not be as big as his. The reputation of a united Egypt is spreading to all corners of the world, and trade has vastly increased your people's wealth. With this prosperity, the Pharaoh Djoser has decided that Amir Mastaba, a simple mud tomb, will not be enough to serve him in the afterlife. Instead, he has ordered the architect Imhotep to design a stepped pyramid that will be visible from miles away. Such a large project will require great resources. You have been ordered to go to the north and set up a trade post to collect the gold for the pyramid. At the same time, you must venture into the desert and find a quarry to supply stone for the construction. Your trading partners, the Minoans, Canaanites, and Libyans, could become jealous of Egypt's success and might even cease trade and attack your people. In case our diplomats fail to keep the peace, you must defend your trade ships. The Pharaoh is entrusting you with the success of this project. Thomas. Yuri.
Don't miss.
Habla más. Oh, no. 
directors.
Donc la main. On baisse. Voilà, là, là. On baisse. With the supplies you gathered, the first pyramid of Egypt is built in honor of Pharaoh Djoza. People from far and wide are in awe of this achievement and Egypt's fame grows. Djoza's successor already has plans to build an even larger pyramid. In time, these structures will dot the land of Egypt and last in eternity, guiding the pharaohs into the next life. Egyptian cult...